Sometimes having too much data that you don't know what to do with can be as much of a challenge as not having any data at all. And in an industry that runs on data, it can be easy to get lost in all of the data input and output that comes through your fleet on a day-to-day -day basis. Welcome to Understanding Fleet Data, a series where we tackle different sources of data and how to best leverage them within your fleet management system. Today, we'll look at maintenance data, where to find it and how to classify it, its role in fleet reporting, and how to use it to evaluate your asset's performance. So let's talk a little bit about classifying maintenance data. Maintenance is at the core of fleet operations, so there's a lot of different places to find maintenance data. So let's check out two primary categories. The first is direct maintenance data. You can find this from sources that track what's actually being done to a vehicle, including work orders, invoices, PM schedules, and service histories. The second is indirect maintenance data. This will be found on sources that don't directly relate to vehicle service, but instead indicate external factors that might affect a vehicle's health, including inspections, fuel usage, and other non-maintenance related sources. Most fleets focus on direct maintenance in their maintenance processes, but diversifying to include indirect maintenance data can give a wider range of insights that maintenance documentation alone can't give you. Now that we know the two types, how do we collect maintenance data? Chances are that you're already collecting maintenance data just by running your fleet every day through things like inspections and work orders. And if you're having trouble extracting data from those two sources, automation could be your answer. And there are a few different ways you can approach automating the collection of maintenance data. Number one is telematics. We've talked a few times in this series about how vital telematics data can be for fleets. And that's no different when applied to maintenance data. Telematics devices are an invaluable tool for tracking vehicle health and can track indirect maintenance data automatically with things like usage hours, true versus working idle time, fuel consumption, and diagnostic trouble codes. DTCs in particular can be a wealth of information to supplement inspections since they often indicate things that drivers can't see on a simple once-over of an asset. The second source you can leverage for fleet maintenance data is fleet maintenance software. Fleet management systems are a vital tool in the collection and use of automated data, but cross-referencing automated telematics and inspection data against a vehicle's baseline metrics in a fleet management software can help you understand how a vehicle is performing relative to its ideal lifespan. You can then use that data to tweak processes to extend a vehicle's lifespan, like moving up PM schedules to accommodate increased usage. Having all that data in an FMS, that's fleet maintenance software, means you have a constant record of your vehicle's condition that makes reporting and even offloading assets a lot easier down the road. And if you want more tips and tricks on managing your fleet data, check out the rest of our Understanding Fleet Data series for more ways to capitalize on the abundance of data at your fingertips.